If you don't have another job, maybe take some courses in AI or something else to say, hey, I need to develop some skills so I don't spend the rest of my life sitting in a parking lot waiting for DoorDash to give me an order and then waiting for the robots to take over. And you'll be sitting in the parking lot watching the robots roll by. You know how many times I go down to Scottsdale now and I see the Waymo cars? Nobody driving. I see them everywhere. It was a novelty two years ago. Oh, look, there's a Waymo. Now I'll be at an intersection and I'm surrounded by them. Right? And it's just going to get worse. And if I go drive down in Scottsdale, because I don't have the Waymos up here where I'm at. But if I go drive down in Scottsdale on a Friday night now, I'll easily see 50, 60, 70 Waymos over a course of a few hours. I see them everywhere. Every single Waymo is a Lyft or Uber ride that did not go to a driver every single time. That's why it's slow. And that's why the rates are way down. It's supply and demand. And the rates are going to continue to go down. Uber and Lyft don't need you. If you want to keep taking crappy rides for low pay, driving your car into the dirt just to keep these apps up until they replace you, that's fine. I'm taking a different approach. I will use these apps. I don't let the apps use me.